the one-person billion-dollar company will soon be here. AI tools will soon be able to replicate the entire output of human employees, potentially leading to the rise of one-person billion-dollar companies. OpenAI co-founder Sam Altman believes that AI will allow entrepreneurs to outsource work that would typically require employees to an army of AI agents, enabling them to focus on their most important competitive advantage. Altman's prediction is significant because it sheds light on how AI will disrupt knowledge work. On one hand, it could empower individuals to build anything they can dream up and create billion-dollar companies. On the other hand, it could make many people's jobs irrelevant and concentrate power in the hands of elites. The article also highlights the potential impact of AI on writing, which is a major use case for AI. The author wonders if consumers of the future will be more writers in their lives. They question if they can use these AI tools to build their own billion dollar company. Before we delve deeper into that, let's first address the question of whether anyone is close to achieving a one person billion dollar company today. According to the article, no existing company comes close to meeting the criteria. The author proposes that a one person billion dollar company should have at least $100 million in annual recurring revenue, ARR, which is a more rigorous metric than just a billion dollar valuation. The article mentions some examples like Midjourney, a generative AI imaging startup that has an impressive annual revenue rate of over $200 million, but still falls short in terms of employee volume. Furthermore, even in the public markets, investment and energy firms come closest to meeting the bar, but they still have too many employees and subcontractors. The reason why a one-person billion-dollar company remains elusive is that the AI technology isn't yet good enough. The article highlights that Altman's CEO betting pool is more of a bet on technology improvement curves rather than the rugged individualism entrepreneurship. The article then explores what would happen if AI technology were to become good enough to fully replace human employees. They call it Syndrome Syndrome, where everyone has equal access to powerful AI agents. While this equal access may level the playing field, it doesn't mean that everyone will be equally skilled in utilizing these agents. The article emphasizes that the same distribution of ability in managing employees, which exists with human bosses, would also apply to AI agents. However, the presence of AI agents capable of replicating human work would lead to a significant increase in the total supply of digital goods. That increase in supply would make generating demand more expensive. While AI may make it essentially free to build anything involving a computer, the world has a limit to the number of digital goods it needs. This would lead to a more specialized and competitive market, tricking margins for broad, horizontal needs. The article acknowledges that these assumptions are crude, but by pushing them to their breaking point, we can explore a more reasonable path. To reach $100 million in annual recurring revenue, founders would need an advantage in taste and distribution. Taste enables founders to have unique insights into solving customers' problems, while distribution allows them to rapidly market their solutions. However, building a 100 million AR business is incredibly challenging. The article provides examples of consumer products and enterprise software contracts to illustrate the difficulties involved. On one hand, consumer products would require a massive audience to achieve the 100 million hurdle rate. On the other hand, Enterprise deals would require some degree of hand holding and likely involve highly technical products. The article concludes that while Altman's prediction of one person billion dollar companies may be far from coming true, there is still a significant opportunity for ambitious individuals to build businesses in the one to 10 million AR range. Building a successful company comes down to details, craftsmanship and culture. A solo founder can start small, leveraging their taste and unique insights to create a product that resonates with a specific audience. It's important to remember that starting somewhere and building an audience, solving unique problems, and focusing on quality can lead to success. If AI makes it such that words are no longer hard to produce, trust will become the core value that translates into any future medium. Do us a favor and please hit subscribe and maybe even tell a friend. Now let's keep the discussion going. Taking a look at...